Welcome back to Wallach Residences. We're back at the tallest building in Singapore and today we have a fully renovated two bedroom ready for you to move in. So let's go. So Wallach Residences is located on Wallach Street named after Dr. Nathaniel Wallach, a Danish surgeon and botanist who was close friends with Sir Stanford Raffles. So in 1822, Sir Stanford Raffles asked Dr. Wallach to come to Singapore and design the botanical gardens which we've come to love today. So let's talk about the location. On to the URA map. Wallach Residences sits in the central region in downtown core planning area and Tanjong Paga sub-planning zone. Exclusive with a population of just 690 residents, is directly integrated with Guaco Tower, which houses Grade A offices, Sofitel, as well as six levels of retail space that provide you with plenty of F&B options and is directly accessible to Tanjung Baga MRT. With a height of 283.7 meters, Guaco Tower is currently the tallest building in Singapore. So let's talk about the nearby amenities and your convenience. So you've got Little Farm Grocers just downstairs at Guaco Tower as well as a whole range of f &B options nearby. You also have Tanjong Paga Plaza which has a hawker centre as well as Fair Price. And then there's a cold storage at Altes, a Fair Price Finest and even Don Don Donkey at 100am Mall. Okay guys, welcome to the unit. Let's go to the floor plan because I want to give you a better grasp of the unit. So the unit sits on the 56th floor, 915 square feet, 2 bedrooms, faces north, means no afternoon sun, it's priced at 3.648 million, exclusive of 236,000 interior design cost and the maintenance fee is $764.40. So the project TOP'd in 2017, 99 year lease from 2011 and houses 181 residential units from the level 39 to 64 of this magnificent skyscraper. So you're walking through the front door and the first thing you're greeted with is this reception counter that the developers have already built in. So the idea is done by chalk and it's immaculately done up with granite countertop. You've got a lot of shoe space over here for him and her in case you're a kicks fan and then just check out the wallpapers that run throughout the home very lovely you switch teams when you come to this wall over here you've got nice metal strips that run across to demarcate the space and then you're coming into the open kitchenette which is this band over here you've got gaggenau appliances which is the hood hob and even a steamer oven over here built in for you then concealed fridge, also gaggenau, very lovely. And flushed is this concealed built-in carpentry for you to put away all your necessaries. Plus there's a Bosch washer come dry over here for the laundry. Then right across, you have a massive granite countertop again, sink and tap over here. Breakfast and dining area set up for you. Then we're flowing directly into a huge, lovely living room that's been set up with such cozy taste. You can see that you've got a feature wall going at the back with an art piece. You've got a hanging chandelier, lovely for you. Right across, Chalk has really outdone themselves. They've put in this feature wall over here with this TV and it has a sole function. I'll show you in a bit, but right now, there's a balcony that I want to show you. So if you step out here with me, you'll find that you're on a very, very lovely skyline view. Just right below you is the rest of Tanjung Paga. So all these are short flats over here. You can see uh, in the far, the iconic Sun Tzu Fang. And then down, all the way down to the right over here, you can see the Singtel building. So that basically takes you into the Orchard Road stretch. And then even you've got Clark Key, City Hall is down. That way, if you sweep across to the right, this is all manual life, Frazier's building. So you're really in the city centre and the heart of where everything is. So let's go inside, I want to show you the bedrooms. If you look down, you'll notice that you've got huge slabs of marble tiles. This is white marble running across all um, the common areas and even into this common bedroom that they kind of set up into like a convertible space. So notice it's open right now, but if you wanted to, there's a concealable sliding door over here that can really uh, close this space up. So you've got the wardrobe going. This is a nice shade of uh, kind of woody tone. 
right? And look at the laminates inside. Very beautifully done up for you. These are quality finishing. There is a single bed set up for you already with a custom headboard over here. You've got a dresser for the missus and then this is the swivel part for you to just push in the TV if you rotate it like such. Okay, now let's go across because you have a lovely bathroom. Simply fantastic. So immaculate marble running across the floor, white marble, and then you've got contrasting black marble for the countertop, the vanity counter, and then carpentry opens up. Finally, we save the best for last because this is the master and you can see that the wallpaper kind of transcends a little bit the tone of the room. You've got beautiful pale parquet on the floorings going all across and an ID backboard designer finishings with a cushion touch going at the back and a little bit of artwork. So the master bedroom enjoys the same skyline view and right beneath you really is a very beautiful unblocked view right across. You can see the greens going up in the far. And of course, no master bedroom is complete without the lovely master bathroom. So the wardrobe is actually attached within the master bathroom already done up for you. You can put in your luggage, so on and so forth. And then there is a huge vanity countertop going here, standing shower to my rear with a rain shower already complete for you. And then of course there's a WC and even a small cupboard to the top ready for your usage. So if you've been loving this home tour so far, then smash that like button and subscribe to our channel and we'll keep bringing you more lovely homes just like this. Right now, let's talk about who this is for. So if you're looking for a fully renovated two bedroom, you just want to pull your luggage and move right in because this is already immaculately done for you, then this would make sense. If you're looking for an investment property, then let's go to the investment angle. So you can see here in the graph that Wallach Residence commands the highest PSF rental at 8.8. .8. PSF per month compared to the nearby developments such as Sky Suites at Anson which commands $5.3 per square foot per month or Altas at $6 per square foot per month. So given its direct integrated MRT access and office building right in the heart of Singapore CBD, even as COVID-19 recovery, you can see that demand for rental in the CBD is rising and you'll be primed to take advantage of this strategic location. So if this feels like your next home, then smash that like button and give us a call. I'm Nick Tan, Sag Singapore, and I'll see you soon.